so glad to be back, so energized, ready to rock and roll. You guys know my affinity towards sports. Like, damn near all sports, doesn't matter what sport it is. If it's on television, chances are I'm watching it, especially football. Pre-COVID, like, there'd be random football games on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Like, I mean, we're talking like a notch above high school football. Kelsey's like, what are you doing? I'm like, there's a football game on, I'm watching it. So, this time of year, more than ever, like, I just start jonesing hard for a little bit of golf because it's cold where we live and we're watching golf on TV. And last, uh, uh, just yesterday, they were in Torrey Pines, just south of where I grew up in San Diego. And you're just like, oh, M goodness, I want to go play some golf. Well, there's seven inches of snow on the ground. I'm not playing golf anytime soon in the great state of Montana unless I just go and hit golf, uh, golf balls on a simulator, okay? So there's a saying in golf, you can't win the tournament day one, but you sure as hell can lose it. And let me explain. So you know how golf works. There's four rounds if you make the cuts. So the first two rounds, everybody's got a chance. Based off of how the scores are, based off of who's playing what and where, like they create what they call a cut line. And if you're below the cut line, you do not get to play on the weekend. Well, you, you make your money when you play on the weekend. So here we are, six holes into our golf tournament, one month down, right? January flew by just like that, 31 days in the books. It's 2021. Everything looks different, right? Nothing looks different. Nothing looks different, meaning maybe you came out of the gates absolutely on fire. I'm so proud of my wife, what she was able to accomplish in January. But newsflash, guys, it was because of the work she did in October and November. So here we are, six holes into our first round of golf, and we're plus seven. Like, this looks like a normal scorecard for me. Like, let's be honest. I, I'm a 12 handicap, but the best 12 you've ever seen, because I have a three-hole stretch where I'm like, god-awful. And then I play fairly well the rest of the way. I don't know what it is. I can't explain it. It just is what it is. My partner would probably argue with me anyways, like, my buddy Quay would be like, no, you just suck all the time. And I, you get really, really heavy when I carry you in golf tournaments. Needless to say, we're six holes into this thing. Whether you started off par, 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 birdie, or double, bogey, par, double, 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 we have an opportunity the next 12 holes to get through this first round. You can write the ship really, really quickly. All it takes is a solid tee shot. All it takes is you getting up and down from a greenside bunker to save par. All it takes is that one phone call in real estate to change the momentum. We talked about it ad nauseum in 2020 when people said, Jeff, what's the market going to look like in 2021? I said, if we thought 2020 was nuts, which I think every single person on this phone call would agree, like we didn't see that one coming. I think we can all agree that 2021 is going to be just as nuts, if not crazier, than 2020. Now, there's opportunity every tee shot. There's opportunity every approach shot. We just have to stay focused and just keep our eye on the prize. One shot at a time, one hole at a time. Chip away at maybe the hole that you might have put yourself in because it was crazy in 2020. And there was a lot of us that needed to take a timeout on life for crying out loud, not even just real estate, a timeout on just like, can we hit pause, please? The reality is we will never be able to hit pause. The world will continue to spin. The world will continue. The sun will come up. The sun will go down and it's a new day. Just last night, Kelsey's like, can you believe our sun will be three in six months? It seemed like yesterday we brought him home from the hospital. And to think that three years has gone by, two and a half years has just gone by. So in the real estate game of golf, you have an opportunity every time to be perfect with one shot. But you can also get off the rails and go OB really, really quickly if we do not stay focused. It's really, really hard to stay focused for that split second that one and a half seconds, that 0.3 seconds, if you have a crazy fast swing, slow it down, by the way, just say, just slow it down. Um, the thing is, you guys have an opportunity. If you put yourself a little slower out of the gate because you deserved it, I'm not taking that away from you. If you slowed down, if you inched your way into January instead of just 
coming right out of the gates and going three under par after your first two holes, it's okay. You have a chance to get that thing back. Just stay focused on the one shot at a time. That's all I got for you guys today. Thank you so much for being here.